I've had this idea for quite a while now. Um, I wanted to show the half pipe from a different angle by painting its walls. I forced the viewer to change perspective and look at the transition only and not what lies above or around. So the whole session went down in locks in uh, late April past season. Christian and myself went up and teamed up with the whole shaping crew of locks to paint the super pipe blue. Painting those 22 foot walls was definitely a mission. Um, we ended up using a snowcat with a crane on it and then our buddy Luca from Snowfrog Locks would repel from there and dye the wall with a hand pump. This process with the snowcat, painting the walls would take a while. So once it was all done, we had to be really quickly because the color would fade quite fast. Since the quick fading of the blue color, we only had a couple tries for each part of the wall that we painted blue. Everything came together perfectly. Christian's car was flawless and I have found my favorite angle. It's always a pleasure to work with Christian, of course. Um, but on this project especially, it was nice to have a rider with a clear vision of what he wanted to accomplish. On one side, this project is really snowboarding driven, showing the key point of transition riding. On the other side, it's sort of a, an art project. I'm definitely blown away to get a Transworld cover. It's been a childhood's dream and um, when Gerard showed me the mag, I was speechless, I didn't even know what to say. And um, yeah, to see your initial idea ending up on the cover is really, really cool. And um, yeah, thanks, guys. Yeah.